Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. As you can tell, I did a pretty big Costco haul. Uh, so I figured I would share it with you guys. I spent $490 on groceries, um, but I did get a few like gift items over there. And I also had to renew my Costco membership and we do get the upgraded membership because we always end up making money. So that was $120 plus almost $500. So it was like a $620 day at Costco, um, but it's just the way it goes. So I kind of organized it. So we're gonna start over here with the few little gift items. So how cute is this? I had to buy this for my youngest daughter. We love Disney and it has this little tulle rose skirt and then the shirt says be your own kind of beauty, which is so sweet. And then it has the little jacket over it. Um, the sizing is pretty small. She usually fits in a size seven and the 10 jacket fit her. That's all we tried on. So this was like 12 bucks for all three of these things. So I went ahead and grabbed that. Um, this was a gift item. Father's Day is actually in two days when I'm filming this. So we got these for my husband's dad. They're Sperry's, which is an amazing brand, and they had them at Costco. Um, something that's not here is two movie tickets to a movie theater in our area. Costco sells... Um, movie tickets a little bit discounted so we got that as another uh, father's day gift for um our brother-in-law then for household items kirkland disinfecting wipes um and then the sunscreen every time sunscreen is on sale i'm gonna go ahead and buy some because we go through so much sunscreen uh now moving over here the produce is definitely like the biggest group which always makes me very happy so I got the small romaine hearts. I like getting these tiny ones because I feel like they stay good longer. I know it's weird. And then we got some carrots. I like how they're making these organic carrots um, in a, like two separate packages now. That's kind of nice. I picked up two pineapples. Going to be making a fruit salad to bring over for Father's Day. So wanted to do that. Um, got some fresh green beans already cut. So nice. Total convenience item, but love it. Two things of bananas, one that's ready, one that's not. Um, organic Brussels sprouts, baby cucumbers, organic grapes, three things of strawberries, again, making a fruit salad, so I wanted to grab some of those. Mini bell peppers, and that is it for the fresh produce. Uh, we needed some tortillas. We do tons of lunches, quesadillas, breakfast burritos, tacos, so always need those. Uh, the light and fit Greek yogurts, got those. Uh, protein bars for my husband and I, and Nature Valley protein for the kids. Uh, I'm actually getting ready to head out of town for the Good and the Beautiful convention, so I wanted to get an easy meal for um, the kids' grandparents who are gonna be staying with them. So grab some buns for some um, hot dogs. And um, Dave's Killer Bread is the bread that I like some English muffins for breakfast, egg sandwiches, that type of thing. We were out of butter, so there we go. And a package of eggs. So now we've gone all through here. So now we're gonna come around to this side of the island. Cereal was on sale, so I grabbed this one and that one. Um, these were also on sale. I normally drink LaCroix, but these are really good, so I am really liking these. Again, on sale, I wanted one so bad I opened it in the parking lot. Um, Skippy peanut butter, you know, that's a household staple. Um, got some Annie's mac and cheese, organic for the kids. Um, these bagel bites were on sale. I don't buy them all the time, but when they're on sale, I do buy them. Uh, they like them. And then cauliflower pizza, two of them. Again, another super easy meal for my in-laws who will be staying. Um, then I got some turkey bacon. Love that for breakfast and then BLTs for lunch. Don't usually get turkey sausages, but uh, my kids asked for them, so we went ahead and got those. Um, the Korean barbecue beef flank steak is delicious. It's thin, very little fat, really love it. 
Um, so it's a certified Angus beef and um, it's really good with stir fry vegetables, edamame, so easy and yummy. Uh, these were a new buy. So these are paleo organic basil and cracked black pepper. They are pork free and keto friendly. Oh my goodness. Uh, but anyways, they are, the casing is not disgusting and, um, they're like, I will make like a sheet, uh, like a one sheet meal, slice these up, add all those, uh, Brussels sprouts and green beans and roast them all. But yeah, they look really good. No added sugar, dairy free, good stuff. But that is hilarious. Now we're seeing that put on food. Um, ground turkey chicken tenderloins for grilling, um, this organic day rake blend for smoothies for my kids. Um, I'm actually making my kids like protein smoothies on their own because we're just eating, they're eating so much. Stir fry vegetables back there, turkey burgers, these were on sale. They're pretty good. I prefer the Kirkland brand, but they don't carry those anymore, which makes me sad. Um, these are nice because one patty has 30 grams of protein, but they're not as good, but they were on sale for like $6.99, so got those. There's the only kind of hot dogs I let my kids eat, and that is still like pushing it for me. Um, but anyway, uh, we got some turkey breast, some basil pesto, the organic Bertoli pasta sauce, and then over here, all the all the snacks. Uh, this Boom Chicka Pop is buy one, get one free right now. By the time you guys see this, it won't be, but uh, that's why I got two bags. And then these are the tortilla chips we love. And that is really yummy and just a nice snack to have. Um, then I got the Mexican cheese for everything we use it for. And then this was a new buy for me. I have never bought their lasagna. But again, I wanted easy meals for my in-laws, so I went ahead and got that. I looked over the ingredient label. It looks pretty pretty reasonable for something that's already prepared. That's kind of the nice thing about Costco is not everything is like crappy <laughs> food because you can see like it's pretty much everything that you would put in a lasagna, but it's just already done for you. So hopefully that's good. Um, but yeah, that is everything that I got at Costco for $490. Let me know if you guys have tried anything new at Costco lately that I definitely need to pick up the next time I go because I'm always there, twice a month at least. Uh, so anyways, please give me a thumbs up if you guys enjoy seeing grocery hauls and want me to keep doing them. And I will see you guys in my next video. Thanks for watching.